Hill, so we're blessed by that. It's the first time a family-friendly movie has ever been released nationwide. SM, Ayala, Robinson's, and the other malls are coming on board as well. December 4th, don't miss it, right? It's gonna be a big deal, so please write about it. This is really time timely. So I'm just going to tell you the vision for this uh, for this movie. Um, Jesse and Christian and our family for the last three years have visited over 1,000 schools for free. And what we found is there's a pent-up demand for hope and love. And families are dissolving here. It's a very tenuous situation in the Philippines right now. And we had this vision of, well, you know, when we go to schools and we talk about no drinking, no drugs, no smoking, no bullying, what if we had some more time? So. We thought about doing a short film, like an indie film, where we could kind of leave that with the schools and the curriculum, no drinking, no drugs, no smoking, no bullying, purity, all that stuff. And then the fundamental thing happened. We called up Stephen Baldwin, who we know, and we said, would you come out and help us with, sorry, we said, can you help us with this movie? We'll do a Skype call. We'll get you on a video. We can't afford you. We'll get you just to give a little airtime, right? He called us back three days later and said, the Lord has called me to come out for two weeks to do this film for almost nothing. And it was kind of a mixed blessing because it was like, wow, that's really cool. It's like, oh no, what do we do? So we went from indie film to Hollywood film because he basically said, you gotta have the right cameras, you gotta have the right actors like Alvin Anson. You know, he basically upped the ante. And when that happened, what we said was, you know, if we're gonna do this, it's a chance of a lifetime to do the right thing and to really do something that's never been done before, which is create a family friendly film with values, but also to set up the industry for higher quality lower costs, treating people better, all those kind of things. So we've actually kind of put a corporate dimension into this thing called movie making. So praise God, that's how the vision happened. So uh, Jesse, Christian, come on up. We're going to talk a little bit about the storyline as well. Uh, so you guys can come up. Um, Jesse and Christian, just a little background. They actually started as actors in the Philippines. Uh, they did a teleseria, a little, some things on a teleseria. But they really wanted to move into singing, and then they said this comment to me, and they said, hey, maybe we'll be big enough one day we'll do a movie. And by the way, the chances of that were zero. That could never happen in this country, right? And now, four years later, here we are with our friends, Vinny Saturno, Alvin Anson, so many people that came together to make this thing happen, and now they're in a movie with a Hollywood actor, and it's really the first time this could go, a Hollywood, really a movie that's like Hollywood could go worldwide. Now you might be wondering, why is the movie in English? It's because when we first did the movie, we decided that this had to be ready to go to a worldwide audience. So we're already talking to big people in the US about bringing this to the US audience, and Korea, and other places as well. So praise the Lord, and thank you guys for coming. Uh, this is Jesse Perkins, Christian Perkins. And just the other kind of fascinating thing about this movie is, we actually did the storyline, and we did the script. Now what's fascinating about that is we sent this to US to get some validation on that and they came back and said this is a great script don't change it. So with that in mind we came up with this movie and Jesse and Christian will talk about that. Yes, so hello everyone. Uh, magandang hapon po sa inyong lahat. Ako po si Jesse Perkins. And ako po si Christian. Hello everyone. And we're, we're the twins. Um, we're, the, we're the two guys here in the, in the, the poster thing. But uh, first of all, we just want to thank everyone, all of our kaibigan from the press for, for coming out today. I know all of you are very busy and the traffic is, is getting pretty hectic. Uh, with the Christmas season, season coming around, but thank you all for giving us your time. We're, we're just so blessed to share this this movie and also our message with all of you and Sana, the whole Philippines can hear our message as a result of this. But thank you all for coming. Like my dad said, um, this is this is really a miracle how this movie even started, but just in terms of the plot, my brother and I were not brothers in the film. I don't know if you could tell from the, the trailer, but we're not brothers, in fact, um, we're parang rivals at the beginning. Parang, it's called Kaibigan, but at the beginning, parang kaaway kami. So um, it's all about kind of two different kinds of lifestyles. So one of the characters lives a lifestyle that's very worldly and he does a lot of reckless things. He, he lives a, in a reckless uh, way. And then there's the other side, the other student who kind of lives a more conservative, uh, um, uh, if you will, uh, a good lifestyle. So we're kind of trying to show, especially for the, the young people, but for everyone, there are always kind of two ways to live a life. If, if, you, if you choose one way that has a lot of uh, 
uh, wild things. If you do bad things, quote bad things, there will there can be a lot of consequences. But if you do the right thing, there can be a lot of rewards. So that's kind of the theme of the film, and it's also called Kai Vegan because we're trying to show na that but especially for the young people, you should be a real friend to one another, and that means influence them in the right way and stuff like that. So in this film. I don't know if I can tell, I don't want to spoil it then, but um, one of us tries to influence the other one and they don't like each other. One of them gets kicked out of his old his school to, uh, because of reckless behavior and he ends up transferring to the same school. So that's kind of where the conflict arises and at that, that time there's there's jealousy, there's, uh, but I'm, is it worth it to help this guy? But at the same time, is it worth it to change my life? So there are a lot of cool dynamics like that. And there's a lot of basketball in the movie, music. It's a really fun film. So it's not puro messages. Nah, it's going to be boring. But um, we, we hope to entertain people when they watch it. But at the same time, when they come out of the movie theater, naman they'll be inspired to make some significant and important changes in their lives. So Yon, I'm Jesse. Here's my twin brother. Yes, and uh, thank you again for everyone who came out here today. We're really uh, grateful for all of you to come here and uh, check out this movie. And uh, like we've been saying, uh, we just want to sana inspire people with this movie and uh, also put the Philippines in a good light, like my dad mentioned kanina. Uh, we're talking to people internationally about this, but we really want to promote the Philippines and uh, through this movie and sana inspire people through the movie as well. So Yun, uh, I think we're gonna be talking a lot more later on, but that's it for now. And uh, marami marami salamat po sa inyo. Yeah, we thank, thank you all, we love you guys.